Did you know there's a platinum achievement inside the world made for in-game players? And I'm gonna tell you how I managed to get all four on the same mission. Let's find out what are these rare cosmetics and how you can get them too. Almost three years ago I went on a mission to try to finish these banner challenges on the same mission. I knew it wasn't gonna be easy, so I had to plan out a strategy. I was constantly tracking my progress on each challenge, calculating how much progress I was making after each mission. In summary, the challenges require saving 10,000 survivors, building half a million structures, exploring 1500 zones, and doing 1000 plays with other missions. If that sounds like a lot, it is because it is, but don't worry. Here's how you can get by those missions. This is one by far is the talented builder, since you do it passively with every mission you do. But you can complete this banner mission in one go. You can start in SSD and then start building like crazy alongside three other friends and breaking everything once you reach the SSD structures limit. Once you are happy with all the progress made, run an SSD or water games mission successfully and you'll be done with this challenge in no time. Another passive challenge is the World Explorer banner. Just make sure to fully explore the map on every mission. It helps a lot to pin this mission to track the progress made and run in missions like repair the shelter and rescue the survivors because those almost guarantee you to fully explore the map. Fordian Angel may be the mission that takes the most time, since on a regular mission you may find around 5 survivors and 15 unrescued survivors. That means that you'll have to run 667 fully completed rescued survivors missions alone to complete this madness. But the one that takes the cake for madness is plays well with others. This literally takes you out of your way to do 1000 missions with random players. Missions in Stonewood are a lot faster to complete since you can build an ultra basic defense, then throw a thunder to a base and call it a day. But since this is Stonewood, you'll definitely run into a trade scammer at some point. Just ignore them and try to do the other challenges in the meantime. So to get mine at the same time, I run lots of Stonewood plays well with other missions, fully exploring the map and saving all of the survivors. I tried to get close to completing 9099 plays well with other missions and then run exclusively save the survivors missions to keep up. And when the time came I run an SSD to complete the half a million structures and from there it just took running a Twine Peaks plays well with other missions. I landed in a repair the shelter mission and it just took saving my last two survivors, building 84 more structures exploring the zone and completing the mission to earn that precious platinum. It definitely took a lot of time and coordination but I had a lot of fun doing it. And I hope you'll get yours soon. Thanks a lot for watching, consider subscribing if you like this and I'll see you next Dire Monday.